Hey, Matt Williams here with Trail and Ultrarunning.com here to talk about the Velo 2 from STM Bags. And today we're just going to go through the features of the bag and all the many things that you can do with it as part of our lifestyle series. I'm going to start right from the top and work our way down through the bag. The Velo 2 comes in two different sizes, the small, which we have here, as well as a medium size, which is going to hold larger laptops. The small is big enough for a 13-inch laptop, and it's amazing how much stuff you can hold in this small bag. When I first saw the bag, I thought, that's going to be too small for anything that I can do. I've got too much stuff that I have to carry to and from work. I don't think that's going to cut it. However, once I started to actually fill up the bag, I was pretty amazed with what I could do. So I'm going to start at the top here. The strap has a nice padded strap. Working our way down, it's got a swiveled band and then the adjustable strap. Coming down the straps, we've got these really nice pockets. I put my power cord in this side. It's out of the way, so if you don't need your cord, you're not digging through your bag around it to try and find something else, but it's there when you need it. In this side, I do the same thing. I have my other cords. I keep them in a sunglass, like a spare sunglass bag. It works really well for that. Um, lots of space here, perfect for a water bottle if you want something in the side there. Back up top here, there's a really sturdy, really comfortable handle. There's a nice little handy pocket here, pretty small, but it's perfect for cell phone keys. Going through the airport, throwing what you need in right there. As we open up the, the flap here, it's got a couple different things. As you can see here, I've got my running shoes stashed in the bag. I'm going to pull those out. We've got a zippered closure here, so I can go ahead and close up the bag. And one of my favorite things about this is that the bag can remain zipped and clipped, but I can still unclip it and access my other smaller pockets. That's really nice if you're, again, walking through the airport, in and out of the office. It really gets you in and out of what you need. The main pocket, as what most people would call the main pocket, will carry a, your iPad, Kindle, anything else that you need to fit in there, it's gonna fit right in here. You'll notice my laptop is not in this main pocket. I've got all my other stuff in here. I got my running clothes. I've got like extra wallet, ID, my mouse. Everything in here has a pocket that has a place. And that's one of my favorite things about this bag. Two main pockets up front here, and then two big pockets for your iPad or other tablet device. Where's your laptop? This is, again, one of my favorite things about this bag. If you turn to the side, you'll notice there's a secret zippered pocket completely padded all the way around, and this is where your laptop's going to store. Again, going back to the airport scenario, no more digging through your bag to pull out your laptop. You can pull it in and out, and you're on your way through security. It also makes it so that you have more security, more padding. You're not going to tip over your bag and have your laptop fall out. It's in there for good unless you pull it out. So let's take a look at the main front smaller compartment here. This is your standard organizational pocket. This is where I keep my gum, my pens, my styluses. It's got a key loop. And then there's a nice handy pocket right here on the outside or, uh, of that. That's a, it, it's kind of a metallic mesh. But the thing that I love about it is that it's actually see-through so you can see what you're looking for. So this is where I keep things like my contacts, my earbuds, some batteries, USB thumb drives, things like that that are small but you want to be able to see where they're at. And then right here on the outside pocket, very simple uh, single pocket. It's where I keep things just to have close at hand. Chapstick, maybe some earbuds, and maybe a treat for the road. A couple other things on this bag. There's a clip right here, a little, a little loop right here for cycling. You can, you can clip a light onto there so that you can be more visible as you ride your bike. And then flipping the bag around, we've got a couple more things here. We've got a back pocket. This is great for magazine, book, even another tablet if you're on the plane. And then another cool thing is that the uh, zipper unzips here and it becomes a flow-through pocket. So you, if you've got a roll-away um, carry-on bag, this will slip right on there and, uh, and you don't have to worry about lugging it around. Another feature that's nice is you've got these points and straps right here on the back of the bag that are going to actually allow you to stabilize the load with, with the buckle. So if you're riding a bike, maybe running to go get the bus, this will actually give you another point of contact so that you can get on your way without the bag bouncing around everywhere. So that's a quick look at the Velo 2 by STM Bag. 
Post in the comments if you have any questions or you've used the Velo 2 yourself and let us know what you think. For more information about the Velo 2 by STM Bags, visit trellandultrarunning.com or stmbags.com. <laughs> <laughs>